Get ready for your daily dose of marketing strategies and tactics from entrepreneurs with the guile and experience to help you find success in any marketing capacity. You're listening to Marketing School with your instructors, Neil Patel and Eric Sue. Welcome to another episode of Marketing School. I'm Eric Sue. And I'm Neil Patel. And today we are going to talk about how to get social media traffic when you have no followers and no money. Neil, what are your thoughts around this? The easiest way to get social traffic when you have no followers and no money is look at the content that you're writing in your blog. Take it. Google similar keywords and find other posts. Look at the ones that are popular. Put them into search.twitter.com or Twitter search box. It will show you every single person that shared that post. Shoot them an email. Hey, so-and-so, I noticed that you shared out X, Y, and Z article by author A, B, and C. I actually have a similar article that's coming out, but mine discusses one, two, and three that theirs doesn't. Let me know if you want to check it out before I release it. Cheers, Neil. A lot of times they'll respond. You're talking about in the double-digit percentile in which they'll respond. And once they respond, you shoot them a link saying, here you go. If you'll enjoy it, or if you can say something like, here you go, if you like it, Feel free and share it. Cheers, Neil. It's that easy. By doing that, you'll get more social shares. You don't really need to do much more. Yeah, I'll keep mine pretty simple. I mean, you know, thinking about tags when I'm on Instagram, those actually work out pretty well. And, you know, when I look at uh, the growth everywhere Instagram, we have about 6,400 followers right now. And, you know, it it was, you know, we were getting pretty poor engagement, though. So, you know, what we did was, I mean, we basically look, you know, redid the tags that we're looking at and we decided to basically rejigger them. And, you know, we had we have like three or four different kind of sets of tags that we choose all the time and we alter um, throughout them. And then that's helped us get more followers uh, for sure. And, you know, definitely more engagement. And, you know, the, the one follow up I have to that also is with Instagram. I like using DM a lot. Um, also, the person that manages our growth everywhere, Instagram, we DM a lot of different people just to... Um, just to see, you know, how we can collaborate with other people and, um, you know, how we can kind of, you can also build pods with people too, which is why I like Instagram DMs and pods are basically where, you know, you are grouped up with other people that you, and you guys are trying to promote each other's new posts, right? So these are, uh, you know, let's say Neil posts something new and then you'll post into the, Neil will post into pod saying, hey, I just posted something new. Everybody else will come in, comment on his new picture, uh, like it, whatever, and then they'll engage and then by doing that, you know, everyone kind of gets benefits, right? Everyone's helping each other in, in this pod. And what you want to do is you want to get into multiple pods and then you want to add a lot of value in the beginning too with Instagram DM. Think about how you can help people and then you get into these pods. Um, and you don't need to have money to do this. You just have to be uh, willing to hustle. You have to be willing to dedicate, you know, maybe an hour or two hours. Or if you're crazy, maybe four or five hours a day just DMing people, reaching out to people, right? Because, you know, being able to find these kind of um, these, you know, the right people, uh, through Instagram, people are hanging out on Instagram because you know there's a lot of attention there right now. So before we go, we have a one-year annual subscription of Crazy Egg worth close to twelve hundred dollars that we would like to give to you. So before I give you details, Neil, what is Crazy Egg? Crazy Egg is a visual analytics tool. Google shows you, or Google Analytics shows you numbers. But the problem with those numbers are, it's not really clear on what changes you need to make to grow your sales and conversions. So with Crazy Egg, it's a visual tool, it's a heat map, it'll show you where people click, where they don't. They even have a scroll map report that shows you how far people are scrolling down because if all your call to actions or your form fields are too far down and no one sees them, well now you'll know, hey, you need to move them up. It'll also show you visitor recordings of mouse movements of where people are clicking, where they're getting stuck so you can modify your funnels and your landing pages. And the cool part about Crazy Egg is when you're making all these modifications to your site, you can do it in the Crazy Egg WYSIWYG editor. From there, you can run split tests and A-B tests within Crazy Egg to make sure that your changes are maximizing your sales, leads, and conversions. Great. So if you want to get in on this, we are giving away one of these every single week. Just go to singlegrain.com slash giveaway. And the cool thing about this is that you can actually get multiple entries. So if you want to find out more about that, just go to singlegrain.com slash giveaway, and we will see you tomorrow. This session of Marketing School has come to a close. Be sure to subscribe for more daily marketing strategies and tactics to help you find the success you've always dreamed of. And don't forget to rate and review so we can continue to bring you the best daily content possible. We'll see you in class tomorrow right here on Marketing School.